Hi, uh, I'm Andy. I'm one of the lecturers in the ESOL department. I'm also the, one of the main, the main course tutor on the CELTA course. Uh, thanks for clicking on the link. Uh, so what I'm going to do is give you some information about our department, the different aspects of it, and how we work, what we do. So enjoy. So here's some of the team uh, working hard from lockdown. We're all in contact with our students, sending them emails, speaking to them on the phone, having Zoom lessons. So they're still getting the English that they need. We're, we're, we're still providing them with the information and the ability to practice their English, even though they're not in, in college. Um, a little bit of trivia, the entire ESOL department, uh, we've got over 100 years of teaching experience between us. Um, we don't look that old, but there's a lot of experience there and we're all working together to help our students to improve their English and gaining confidence. One of the biggest provisions we have in our department is ESOL, which is English for Speakers of Other Languages. Uh, basically, these are English lessons delivered to people from settled communities in the area. Uh, we have asylum seekers, uh, people who have been granted leave to remain, migrant workers, and the parents and spouses as well. Um, our students have many, many different motivations for improving their English. It could be from wanting to help their kids with their homework, to going to university, getting a job, being able to integrate, talk with their neighbours. You know, there are many reasons why they want to uh, improve. The levels and the courses that we offer, we start right at the beginning. Starter level, students who could be possibly even illiterate in their own language, let alone in English. But as they develop and they go through the levels, we finish at level two, the upper intermediate class. From there, students can then go on to do GCSEs or vocational courses as well. We also have writing classes. So for all the levels, writing is a difficult skill for some of our students to master. Um, and we also have ESOL for health workers, uh, ESOL for taxi drivers, not so much the speaking and the listening, but again, the writing aspect of this is important for them. We do Life in the UK, a test preparation course. A lot of people who want to get settled status in this country will need to do the Life in the UK test so we can offer help with that uh, with regards to materials and practice. Uh, Living in the UK is a course that we do that integrates into our ESOL classes whereby you learn about British values, prevent and what it is to live in the UK and integrate. As a bonus as well, every time we do our CELTA course, which you'll hear about later on in the presentation, we offer free English classes. So if you're happy to come along and be taught by trainee teachers, you can have free English. And as well as the English, we actually do functional skills maths for all levels from entry one right up to level two. If you're in a full time class in these lessons, you will actually part of your week, you will be studying maths. Even if your maths is good, it might be the English part of the maths that's the problem. That's what these lessons are for. The EFL department, uh, which is where we do English as a foreign language, different from ESOL because the students here actually live abroad. They just come to this country in order to improve their English before they go back. Um, they are also those that want English to either get a job in their own country or they may actually want to stay here, study and go to university in the UK as well. So the courses that we offer in this department, we have business and specialist English courses. 
Um, very important it's IELTS preparation, both academic, general training and skills for life. The IELTS is important if they want to go to university to get accepted into universities. And linked to the university are the pre-sessional courses. Um, if the student's English is not quite good enough yet, we can offer a pre-sessional course to prepare them before they start their university. Uh, we do intensive general English, so students who might only be coming just for a few weeks. And all of these can be delivered online or on campus. Our EFL students um, get the additional benefits of supported self-study. We have a whole load of online resources that they can access and a social programme which can include day trips in the local area. We also do the CELTA in, in our department, which is the Certificate in English Language Teaching to Adults. It's the most widely recognised initial training qualification for EFL teachers. Uh, if, you want to, if you want to work for the British Council anywhere in the world, you need to do the CELTA. And it, it's, a, it's a level five equivalent. It's for anybody who has got some kind of postgraduate qualification. You don't need to have teaching experience either. Uh, we have candidates who do the CELTA course who have come from a teaching background and those who have never taught before. It doesn't matter. The most important thing is if you are interested in working in a language school, be that in the UK or abroad, this is the qualification that you need. It, it's the gold standard. The way the course uh, runs is we offer full time or part time. We have a four week or a five week intensive full time course and we have a part time evening course which runs over 20 weeks. The course itself consists of six hours of assessed teaching practice. So you delivering lessons to students and being assessed by your tutor. There are six hours of observations. So you will actually go and observe teachers in their classrooms delivering their lessons. Or we will also be using uh, video lessons from the British Council. Um, there are four assignments that have to be written and they are assessed as part of the overall qualification as well. And together with the practical side, there's the theory. So classroom based input sessions delivered by your tutors, looking at the different aspects of teaching, such as classroom management, doing error correction, how you deal with pronunciation or teaching of the different skills. We're, we're very proud at Highbury that we actually have, to date, we have a 100% pass rate on our CELTA course. If you have any questions or if you need any more information on any of the things that you've seen in this presentation, please contact Cosham. Or if you're in Portsmouth City Centre, we're based in the Arundel Centre, so come on and ask us some questions. Thanks for listening and well, we hope to see you soon.